so some people have been asking me or in the comments about what I played during this song and how to play it. So I'm just going to go through real quick. I'm not going to take too long, but I'm going to show you what's being played for the most part. Uh, at least from what I can tell and I've made some improvements on what I played listening to it again. Uh, basically you come up here and play G sharp. Alright. And what it's doing is it... So what I'm playing there is I'm just making a C shape, okay, from the 8th fret, alright, so 5, 6, 7, 8, you're barring all these, just like making a C down here, okay, you're going to do it up here. Now you can play this with just a D shape, you can kind of do that and let the music behind you carry it, but if you want to play it with the guitar, the chord and all, just make a C shape. All right, and it should sound like this. All right, then what you're gonna do is take off those fingers and just put your first finger here, all right, or your little finger here, to this. All right, this is an E, F, F minor seven. All right, so. What you're just gonna put this finger here this one here on the B string, keep it barred. You move it back up. All right, what it's really playing is this note here is over it. But I don't play this note. I just let the bass or whatever else do it. And you come up here to a C sharp major seventh, which is, all right, you're gonna play it up here. So you're gonna put your first finger up here, all right, on the ninth. You're gonna keep that keep that minor shape, an F minor, right? But what you're gonna do is bring this finger up and over, and then you want to hit that bottom. So leave the back of your finger on there, okay? And then what I do is I come here. So again, it's the same shape except I'm putting this finger here. So I go from. So in this case, I'm putting this finger here, keeping these two barred, and then, so like that. Because it's, it's doing, now you're moving it down, so you're barring all these, and you're going to put this finger here. Now you can play it full, barring the top as well. I just make it easy and just hit like three or four notes. Or... Now in the video I just kept it here and all I did was I just played these three notes. So you can you can do it here. So you're basically just playing the C sharp to an E flat. Alright, it repeats. Now in the video, I'm going to show you two ways to play the bridge. You can play C-sharp here, G-sharp, E-flat, and then this F minor 7th. Alright, so it would be like a down, 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 up, 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 down, 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 to this, which is going to be, you 
could say B flat or A sharp. Okay, just a uh, bar chord. And now, I've seen people in other videos go to D. Uh, but they hit, they hit this and the song, which it's not going to do that on a D. So I think it goes to a C, uh, or a C sharp, I mean. Uh, it could... Uh, that's what it I, sounds like to me. Now, in the song, they're playing it a little higher. They're playing this C sharp here. Back to that C shape I showed you. Which is the same thing as this. Alright. To this. Then, here, this little A sharp or B flat. What instead, it sounds like they go up here. And they're playing that same C shape, but they're just moving it up a step. So it's like a... Like that, okay? And then it goes back to the chorus. Something like that. So you can kind of stop it like this. You can kind of let it ring. Back to that A sharp to this, which is a, a C sharp minor. All right. Uh, the way I played it is you come up and you bar. There's five, six, seven. Okay, the ninth fret, and you bar them all, and you're just putting these two fingers here. All right. Now that's the first and second verse. When it gets to the bridge, you go back to that. C sharp major seventh, okay? Now I played it up here. Then you go to a C seventh. To play this, you're gonna bar the third fret, put this finger here, and this one here, okay? Go up to that F minor seventh from before, move it down a step to a E flat minor seventh, or you could say D sharp, whatever. And then what I did is I just hammered up. So. And then you go back to that C sharp major seven. All right. And then it goes, uh, da, 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 da. and it goes back to that. It's an E flat, okay? I just do a power chord there. And then in this, at this point, you go back to that G sharp you started with. Now you can just do whatever here. There's, I don't think there's really much guitar going on. What I did is I did... So... And all I'm doing there is I'm doing... Back to that chorus. All right, it goes back to that. All right, and at the end, you're gonna go to that, just like it started. Now it goes into a little solo thing here. The one that I did in the video, I, I just kind of went up. I, I did it down here. Or, all right, uh, I'm gonna do it up higher because I like it a little better. And basically, I just come up here. Something like that. So it's. And the way, if you wanna play it like this, you can just go up to this fret here, all right? I'm just gonna call it out so there's 12, 13, 14, so there's 16. And you're just going down. All right, to the 14th, 13th. So.
Uh, I didn't like the way it, because before I did, like, I think it sounds better if I do something like a. Now I did. All right. Uh, or you can do. Uh, So you can do like a... Uh, anyways, just have fun with the song. That's that's basically uh, just everything that I played in the song. and I, I tweaked it a little bit to try to get it more accurate. So I hope you guys enjoy and let me know if there's anything else you want me to try to learn. Not the best guitar player out there, obviously, but I have fun learning and I have fun doing covers, so hope you guys have a nice day.